Hello, welcome to the Met Office 10 day trend in which we take a look at some of the likely weather patterns during the upcoming weekend into next week and the start of the following weekend. And it looks like after a dry spring, well, the next 10 days will bring with them some rainfall. Sunny spells and showers typically during the next few days before there are indications that a deeper area of low pressure will arrive to the west of the UK around the middle of next week, perhaps giving some more organised wind and rain at times. But the main focus during the next 24 hours or so is across East Anglia and the southeast, where we could see some intense thunderstorms on Friday evening. Now, by Saturday, that clears into the continent, perhaps some severe weather affecting northwest Europe, whilst the UK into a much fresher air of weather, area of weather, with a mixture of sunny spells and showers on Saturday. And as we go into Sunday, another day of sunny spells and showers. The worst of the showers at first across northwestern parts, but perhaps something more organised coming into Wales and the southwest of England by the end of Sunday. Always the best of the sunny spells in the east. However, the southeast will feel much fresher, much less humid than it's been recently. Nevertheless, still pleasant enough in the sunshine. So a mix of sunny spells and showers this weekend, feeling a little cooler in the southeast. Now, as we start off next week, there are indications that those sunny spells and showers will continue for a time. And once more, they'll be organised on various weather fronts that will move across the UK. For example, one going through southern parts on Monday and clearing by Tuesday. Tuesday itself starts off fairly showery, but looking out to the west, a ridge of high pressure starts to build. Now, this could give a spell of more settled weather around the middle part of the week. But lurking on the horizon, another area of low pressure. And the interesting thing with this area of low pressure is that it's going to be deepening rapidly around the middle of the week because the jet stream is strengthening and that will help to deepen and provide the energy to deepen that low pressure. An unseasonably deep low is possible by Wednesday and Thursday. And this is what one of the Met Office longer range models is indicating around the middle of next week. Low pressure, a deep area of low pressure to the west of the UK. And given its positioning, it looks like the most unsettled weather, the strongest winds and the heaviest rains will be across northern and western parts of Britain. However, if we follow the winds around that low pressure, you can see they just about come up from the south, from the near continent into the southeast corner. So once again, there's that chance or that risk that we'll see higher humidity and potentially thundery plumes continuing to affect the southeast corner from the middle of next week. So unsettled with rain or wind in the northwest, humid with the risk of thunderstorms in the southeast. This is the weekend and spot the difference. Low pressure still in more or less the same position, still the most unsettled weather to the northwest, but once more the risk of some more humid air and thunderstorms in the southeast.